Hello everybody, this is Grant, Developer Evangelist on the OpenShift team at Red Hat. One of our community members created and contributed a Windows installer for the RHC and OpenShift command line tools. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use that installer. First thing you'll want to do is go to the GitHub page where the project is located. On this page there are some instructions. The first thing you need to do is install NSIS. So you can click on the SourceForge page here and then once that loads you'll want to click on the download button. And I'm going to download the 3.0 version. I'm going to save this file to my desktop. And then I'm going to run the installer. At this point I'm going to go back to the GitHub page and you need to download the source code for the installer. I already have Git installed on my system so I'm just going to select the Git read only URL, copy that, open up a command prompt, and then git clone that repository. Once the code has been downloaded, all you need to do is open up a file browser, go to that directory where you downloaded the source code, right click on the script file and choose to compile it. You now have an install program that you can run. So I'm going to click on to install that, select yes, and this will walk me through the installation of the RHC command line tools. You can select whether or not you are using a proxy for the gem install, I am not. It will also walk you through installing Git on your system if you do not already have that installed. At this point, you should now have RHC installed on your system. That's all there is to it. Thanks a lot for watching this video.